So I've decided to start with Beginning of Logic by E.J. Lemon. Hopefully I did pronounce this one right. Because, first of all, I haven't done logic since I was like in high school or something. I don't think I've done any logic at university. And I thought this would actually be quite interesting. And also because, for me, at least, logic is like the basic, basic part of math. So that's what I kind of know about it, is that it actually helps. And I used to love these tables when I had to do them in school. They were actually fun, but they're like very complicated. I don't remember all the signs because I don't remember this one, for example. That's probably is not Q and or something. But I'm gonna see how it goes. Very excited for this. major to be fair just like random notions on like premises conclusion sound or valid unsound or invalid and like random examples and again some sort of definition of logic the study by symbolic means of the exact conditions under which patterns of argument are valid or invalid or sound and unsound and then just like notation for conditional and negation which I kind of remembered okay and then some like very easy example on how like a huge sentence it's like a very nice short thing okay so like I said I did do just eight pages the book has around 200 or something many 213 or something i am actually not sure if i will do the whole book maybe i will who knows so i do want to do this kind of like complicated bits but i'm not sure if i will actually do all of the things in the text but i'm quite excited 
Anyway, if you remember what I said at the beginning, that like I thought logic is like the basic, basic part of math and it's like at the beginning and we needed logic and stuff before we could do math, I was actually wrong. So did you talk about symbolic logic here? So it is sometimes also called mathematical logic, which probably is what made me understand that it's part of math. Partially because the rigor achieved is similar to that already belonging to mathematics and partially because contemporary logicians have been especially interested in arguments drawn from the field of mathematics. So actually, I could say it's not exactly the same thing. I could say it's something that like helps maths or something, but it's not the same, same thing. So I got quite excited after this. Anyway, just eight pages, so I am over here and I will put like my book sign, which is like an oval. And it does this. And I like it so much. It's so cute. Anyway, so I will take pictures of these pages and I will put them on my Tumblr. And I'll write a couple of like extra things, maybe. If they need more like extra notes, but I don't think they need. But you'll have all the information in the description box below, so hopefully that's going to be useful. Anyway, see you next time.